What's up, Spidey? We just learned a clue about Daniel's past. We actually figured out where he went to high school, so I think we should go there right now. But today's a school day. There's going to be so many people there. No, 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 wait. Remember, I hacked the weather app. So what does that mean? It says that it's snowing. I mean, it's not really snowing, but I hacked the app, so it, like, seems like it's snowing. So school's canceled because everyone thinks it's a snow day. Snow day. Wait, school's canceled? What? Oh, wait. Oh. What? What's this? Regina, you did it! Oh my gosh! You go, girl! Let's turn on the weather channel and check it out. Over here, got a TV. Meteorologist Matt Hoffman here with a breaking weather alert. A blizzard warning is in effect for the Las Vegas Valley. Yes, you heard that correctly. Six to eight inches of snow is expected to pile up. Everyone in the area is advised to stay inside today as a strong and extremely unprecedented cold front is sweeping through the Southern Valley. I can't believe they think it's snowing in Las Vegas. Yeah, it's like 90 degrees right now. <laughs> this is amazing. Well, all I did was hack the radar and it made it seem like a blizzard's coming over. Oh, oh what? What, what the heck? Our live weather camera shows you just how bad the roads are and how strong this snowstorm is. Never in my life have I seen such an event like this and in October. Unbelievable. Yeah, and where'd that picture of snow come from, though? Wait, it actually is snowing? I used the handy-dandy VID. I just put a picture of a blizzard on their cameras. <laughs> <laughs> Regenius strikes again. Regenius. Big brains. This strange weather does come with good news, though, for the kiddos, as classes in Southern Nevada are closed for the day. Well, Daniel, are you ready to go to your high school? Yes, finally, we're gonna find out everything. Hey, hey, wait a second, wait a second, Regina, I gotta check something real quick. Four days left to open your secret room. Ooh. Getting so close. Let's just get to the mission, guys. Okay, here we go. Dude, your trick totally worked, Regina. There's no cars in the parking lot here at the school. Boy, Regina, there's no snow. Everyone thinks it's a snow day. Oh, yeah. You didn't actually make it snow. You just tricked people. One day you should learn how to actually hack the real weather. That'd be awesome. Okay, let's go inside and let's try to find like an old yearbook or something and something that will show us clues about your past, Daniel. Yes. Let's go. The door's got to be around here. Yeah. Maybe my mom went here or something. Maybe she works here. Maybe she's a teacher. Or the principal. That would be very helpful. Oh, I hope not the principal. Wait, it's locked. Oh, my lock is chained up. V, you're a lock picking expert. Just pick the lock and let's go inside. Oh, you're right. Let me get my lock picking kit out of my spy ninja. Wait, we can't break into a high school? So there's no trespassing. You're right. We can't just break into places that don't belong to us. That's the wrong thing to do. We have to, like, talk to the principal and have him let us in or something, right? Right, that's the right thing to do. But if school is closed, the principal is not here right now. Okay, okay, but what about some of the other clues? Like, it said third GR. Maybe there's something else around here that's maybe outside, like maybe a baseball field or something. Like there's a clue on the third base? Yeah, that green note, it said field and three. Yeah, so, not, and we're allowed to go on there. It's not locked. It's right over there. So you used to be a baseball expert, right? I mean, we did find pictures of me when I was little. I was holding a baseball. I was, had a baseball hat on. Maybe I was on the baseball team at high school. Oh! oh. I, I don't know. Still, I don't understand. What am I going to find out about my past at a baseball field? Maybe we can split up and see if we can find any hints or clues about Daniel. Okay, I'm going to check home base because I always hit a home run. All right, here's home base. I'm not seeing anything. Let's go see how the others are doing. Maybe there's a clue underneath this thing. Uh, Lift that baby up. Come on, Daniel. Uh, Let me just peek underneath. It's kind of stuck. You see anything? Huh. I don't see anything. Picture my mom. Let's check the other bases. Okay. But there's Regina. Go, 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 go. Regina. Yes, yes. I don't know. Check it out. It's a base. What? You know what base this is? Nine! I don't think that's how it works, Regina. Okay, let's run the third! Yeah! To the third base! There's V! What'd you find, V? I was inspecting all the footprints here. There's like seven different two prints here. Whoa! 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 Hey! <laughs> you guys aren't gonna find anything here besides me! What the heck are you doing here, PC9? We're just trying to figure out Daniel's past. I knew you guys were gonna be here. Who else knows how to do a weather hack besides PZ4? What? How did you know that was me? You showed me a long time ago, and I told Project Zorgo that you were all gonna be here. What, PZ9? You're gonna do one of those stupid games you always do again, huh? Yes, because I know you guys have the safe. <laughs> how the heck did he know we have a safe? Well, we can't let him have it because that's how we defeat Project Zorgo once yeah. we open it. Well, what the heck are we gonna do? I don't know, they have baseball bats. Hey, hey, hey. We're gonna do a baseball challenge. How about that? <laughs> if we win, we take it. If you win, we'll tell you more about good old PZ1. Yes, I think we should do this, guys. Yeah. Well, how do we know that he actually knows anything about Daniel? Yo, he could be lying. He's PC9. But we got all those other clues from them. Yeah, he had that whole envelope filled with clues. It was huh? legit. And we've got Daniel. He's a baseball expert. We should be able to beat them easily at these baseball challenges. Sounds good. Let's do it. We take your deal. 
about PZ9? Well, then it's time to play ball! Hey! Okay, fine, PZ9. What's the first baseball challenge? The first challenge will be to hit the ball as furthest as possible. PZ44, throw the ball for everybody. Yeah, yeah, good luck hitting my fastball. First up to bat is PZ9. He's got a GPA of 1.0. How would you know that? Oh, is that how you play baseball? Oh, geez, this is gonna be easy to beat you then. I'll be the catcher. Daniel, you'll be the outfielder. All right, bat off. Ready for this heater? Oh! Uh, strike! Swing and a miss. What? Really? What the heck was that? You're supposed to throw it easy for me. Yeah, I can only throw one way. Oh! Oh! Dang, it went all the way over there. Yeah, how about that? Whoa, look, the ball came all the way over here. Man, based on the dimensions of this field, that's like 100 feet right there. I'm gonna ride in the dirt here. 100 feet. PZ9. All right. That should be beatable, especially for a baseball expert like me, I think. The next batter up is the fabulous V Quaint. That is I. Ready to get dominated? <laughs> That's why I didn't bring a real bat, because I knew V would be all spicy and try to hit me with it. These fine ninjas think they can hit? We'll see about that. I got a mean slider. Is it Oak? Oh. Let's spice this game up. Unfortunately, PZ9 hit it over here. Oh. Okay, Chad, how about you go next? No problemo. I'm surprised you were even able to pick up the bat in the first place, hey. V. <laughs> you don't be smack talking my girl, V. <laughs> well, all right, excuse me. Ah. You're on home plate. You're getting it all dirty. See those fences over there? Way over there? Yeah. Yeah. Keep an eye on those fences. Okay. Here we go. I want you to do one of those special pitches. Oh, he's not ready for this one. You've seen a curveball, right? Well, this one really curves. Hey, wait a minute. Hey! He cheated! He threw a curveball at me, and it was a ball that curved around the bat. Look at this, Daniel. Hey, what are you doing? This isn't the ball you threw at me. No, that's not it. There hey, it it's this one. It's it, one of those squishies. No wonder it did go any further. 44, why are you breaking the rules? We're trying to have a fair and honest game, right? Yeah. I make my own rules. It's fine, it doesn't matter. You can cheat all you want. You're not gonna beat Regina and Daniel, our baseball expert. Let's yeah, that's right. We'll see about that one. Good job, 44. That was pretty evil. Ro genius. Ro genius. Yeah. Guys. Oh, wow, you're violent. You're angry. PC9 is so annoying. Yes. Nobody can hit my knuckleball. Oh, have you played baseball before, Regina? Backyard baseball on the computer, yes. <laughs> hey. That makes no sense. Hey. That means you were sitting on your laptop outside playing baseball. The name of the game was backyard baseball, you dummy. <laughs> God, yes. Go, Regina, go. I'm scared. Ah! Oh, strike one. Ah! Oh, one-handed. I don't know if I'll get this, Chad. You got one more chance, Regina. Don't strike out, Regina. Oh! oh ah! Where'd it go? Oh. Hey! Right there. Right. You know? Whoa! Wow! How did that happen? Wow. Okay, we're playing baseball, not golf. What does she think this is putt putt or something? So does it count or what? No. <laughs> Even if it did count, it's not quite far enough. Yeah, I guess And so. she's out of here! Yay! All right, Daniel, it comes all down to you. Oh my gosh. Just channel your inner expert baseball self. Well, that's the thing, guys. I don't remember really how to play. Maybe it'll just be like instinct. It'll just come back to you naturally. It's muscle memory, yeah. Daniel. Kind of like the guitar. Well, I hopefully not like that, because remember when you tried playing that the other day? It sounded all right. But baseball, it's a little different than guitar, so uh, maybe it'll come back okay. more easily. You're right, all right. All right, PC44, let me... Uh, uh, pitch this one. You better take them out and you know what I mean. <laughs> you got it. Like this, right? You hold it like this. 
I swung that spiked mace before. I swung that bow staff, and I got some pretty good hits. Yeah. So I think I can do it this time. You got this. Are you ready for this? Hey, that went behind oh. him. That's a wild pitch. Wild pitch. Hey, you getting wild? Hey. Who do you think you are, Chad Wild Clay? <laughs> Darn it! Get a lefty picture. You hit him! Hey! You Ooh. okay, Daniel? Yeah, it's just plastic. Oopsies. <laughs> Where did he hit you, Daniel? Right in the buttocks. The buttocks? Yeah! yeah. <laughs> that should that should get That's an automatic walk to first base, but we don't want him on first base. Do we want him to beat your hit? Redo. Alright then, Daniel. If your buttocks can take some more. No 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 no. And my buttocks are so strong. Nice pitch, PZ9. Do it again. Thanks. I put some kung fu into that one. Oh. <laughs> hey! hey! Stop hitting him! I'm oh. oh, sorry. Strike one, Daniel! Daniel Furl sucks though, what the heck? <laughs> I know. Go, Daniel, go! Yeah! Thanks, me! Cheerleader! Ra ra re! Kick him in the knee! Raw, 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 Pick him in the other knee. Come on, Daniels. Whack it. This is a special one. Oh, oh Daniel! That's two strikes! It's not coming back to me, Chad. I'm supposed to be an expert or something? I don't know. Daniel, this is the last chance, man. One more strike, you're out. This is the final swing. It's gotta be in here somewhere. I just gotta think. Muscle memory. All right, you ready for this, Daniel? Uh, yeah. Here's where PZ9 landed. Oh You're, okay. Yours is over here. Daniel, yes. you won! Yeah! PZ9, you suck! You suck! Okay. Well, fine. He's earned a clue about himself. Big whoops. Okay. Well, give us that clue. Long ago, before Daniel was ever a part of Project Zorgo, he had no friends. No friends? Hey. Really? Not much a stranger. Hey! <laughs> You know what? That's a lie. Tell us a real clue, PZ9. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, long ago in Daniel's past, someone very, very important to Daniel lied to him and broke his heart. <laughs> really? That's why he's all about lie detecting. Oh. Wait a minute. Whoa, that makes what? total sense, Daniel. I have trust issues? That must be why you got into lie detecting. Someone lied to you when you were younger and you decided you wanted to figure out if anyone ever lied to you again, you would know. It must have been a huge lie if it traumatizes you, you know? Who lied to you? Must have been somebody really close to me for it to affect me that much and... Okay, if you guys want to know more, let's move on to the next challenge. Our next challenge is three-legged race to first base. This isn't going to work too well because my legs are twice as long as V's. The height difference is just not going to work at this time. Look how tiny my feet are compared to his. I think Daniel and I should have been tied together. It would have been more fair. It's about team building, not team composition. That's fine. V and I will win. PZ44, keep track of the time, please. Will do. Are you guys ready? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Are you ready? Yes. Three. Two, one, go! One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one. Oh, yes, 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 five! Yeah! Woo, that was amazing! Good job, guys! Oh Beat that, PZ9! We'll see about that. What was the time? 6.7 seconds. That's pretty good, boys and girls. We got PZ9 and PZ44. You tie their legs together and you get a PZ53. Woo! PZ53 is a loser anyways. One, two, one, two, one, two, what? Oh! 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 Yeah! We got Spy Ninjas win again! Spy Ninjas win again! Look how dirty they are! Okay, go! Oh! Uh, they're so dusty! Hey! Oh! I'm choking on your dust! 20 seconds! Oh! Yeah, we would have won for sure! You suck! Your fault. You tripped me. Oh I my. think it was your fault. Daniel, how dirty they are. 
<laughs> now you got my outfit all dirty for the rest of the challenge. Enough like bickering. Tell us another clue about Daniel. Well, I guess you guys have earned yourselves another hint. Spit it out. No, come on. Remember I talked about Daniel not having any friends before Project Zorgo? Not again. Ah, uh, yes. Tell us a real thing. It's actually true. True. Before Project Zorgo, Daniel scared away all of his friends. He was so obsessed with finding out if people were lying to him or not after his big old incident because that's all he cared about. Nobody liked me back in the day? I guess if you don't believe your friends and you think they're lying all the time, yeah, they're probably gonna get mad at you, Daniel. Can't believe I was like that. There must have been a good reason for it, like that big incident you said. What happened? Another challenge! Hollywood bases. This is why you wanted to play figure you're a Hollywood star, don't you? I think you need to shut up! This final challenge will be a run from third base to home, but... Make it dizzy. Ha 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 ha! All right, Chad's up. Put him through the spin cycle, 44. All right, let's do it. Uh-oh. Three, two, one, spin him. <laughs> 14, 14. <laughs> How did I do? You're on. Oh, no. That was pretty good. Five and a half seconds. What? Wow. That was really good, Chad. Thanks. It might take a while to recover, but uh, yeah, I'll be fine. PZ4 is next. Uh, I don't want to do that. Ready? Oh, gosh. Three, two, one. One, two, uh. two. <laughs> Twelve, Twelve. 13, 13, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, yeah! Oh, yeah, oh, time! Oh, oh my gosh! Oh. Well, at least she made good time, right? Oh. 30 seconds. A plus for effort, Regina. Oh, thank you, guys. <laughs> oh. Hey, I doubt you'll do any better, PZ9. <sighs> Look who's up to spin. Are we gonna battle royale or do the challenge, V? Whatever it is, I'm ready for it, PC9. Bring it. We can battle royale after. Let's get to the challenge. Let's spin it to win it, V. Yeah! Win it! Three, two, one! Ah! One, two, <laughs> 14, 15! Go! Go! go, 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 go. What's this way! You got it! Ah! Go, go! Ah! Yeah! Good job, V! Okay! Oh, over here! Is this still spinning? V, you got a very special number. Look at what it stopped at. Whoa! 8.88 miles per hour. You're gonna travel through time with that speed. Oh my gosh! Daniel! Oh! Daniel's up next. I don't even know why you're challenging me, PZ9. I'm a baseball expert. I can do all this stuff in my sleep. Time to see if your bark is worse than your bite. Or bite is worse than your bark. I've never heard this before. Spin him! Oh! One! Two! two. 13, oh my God. 14, 15! Oh, no. oh! You got it! Oh, God! Oh! oh. Stop! Stop taking me! Oh. 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 Not bad! 9.19. No! Hey, that's not so bad. Uh -oh. Uh oh, you're not gonna be able to beat any of our scores. 44, make sure they don't pull anything dumb on me. They do look like some cheetahs. Cheetahs? Yeah, we are like cheetahs, cause we're Ooh, fast. Oh yes. It's time for me to crush everybody's time. Spin it! Oh, one, two, three, <laughs> 14, 15, go! Go, go, go! Oh my goodness, look at him, go! Oh! Time was 5.28 seconds! Oh! He beat me! boy, PZ9! Yeah! Alright, PZ9, you won this challenge fair and square, but the Spy Ninjas won two out of three. That means we are the champions and we keep us safe! Yes! But we'll get you all next time. It was a fun challenge, though! 44, let's go! Hey, where are you going? Hey, come back! Ah, forget him! 
We got the safe. We don't need them. And we got some clues about you, Daniel. I wonder what it was that he was talking about that big lie that somebody told you when you were younger. What could it have been? I know. I gotta figure it out because that's apparently what got me into lie detecting in the first place. Today is not a total loss, though. We found more information about Daniel and his past, and we still have the safe. Yeah, yeah. And I'm telling you, Spy Ninjas, keep commenting. The passcode is 2019. I think I've seen about 5,000 of you comment that. I'm kind of getting tired of seeing it, so let's finally just try it, okay? It's gotta be it. Here we go. Two, Two zero, zero, one, nine, enter. enter. Congratulations. <gasps> wait, wait, wait. Shh. You have unlocked the location of the key. My slipperiness. You cannot resist. Gravity assists me in pulling you down with a twist. You get on. Ready for some fun? What am I? What? what? A riddle? What, what uh, kind of safe is this? Just wait, open up! Did you guys listen to it? The safe said you've unlocked the location of the key! There's a spot for a key right here! So Ooh. maybe if we solve the riddle, the key is located wherever the answer to the riddle is! You're right, you're right! <gasps> if you guys know what the riddle is, please comment down below. I can think of it as like a snail? I don't know, slip. Oh! Yeah. Well, since we're at a baseball field, there's gotta be something around here that's related to the riddle. Let's explore! <laughs> How are we ever going to find anything slippery? Wait a minute, you guys. Look right behind us. Yeah, playground. Big deal. No, no us... time for games, V. We gotta no. figure out what the riddle is, V. That's what I'm trying to say, Chad. The slide. It's slippery, like the riddle, and right? gravity brings you down. Because you go down the slides. Maybe it's the cha-cha slide. Oh. Oh. Ah. Do do left. Do oh. right. Do the right. Ah. Oh. You got to learn your left and right. Cha-cha real smooth now. Okay, back to the slide. Split up and look for clues at each slide. Right here. Ah! Uh, uh, oh. It's an envelope. I found an envelope also. Uh, ah! I didn't find anything. It says part one and part two. Let's open be. it. It better be. What? Eagle? That's what rough. is Iron Man doing as a bird? What the heck is what? this? Wait, is that a lobster? These might take a while to figure out. What if we split up in teams? Me and Daniel will take this clue. You guys take that clue. Maybe this will lead us to the key to unlock the safe. And the Strut Brothers are up forever. Split up, we'll talk to you later. What could this clue possibly mean? It's got Iron Man on a bird. What's his real name again? Stark. Yes, Tony Stark. Tony the Tiger. Wait, Tony no, not a tiger. tiger. Tony Eagle. Tony Eagle. Spy Ninjas, if you have any ideas what this clue could mean, Leave a comment down below. Tony Hawk. Tony Hawk is an amazing skateboarder. Wait a second, skateboarding. There's a skate park around here. Maybe the key is at the skate park. B, you figured it out. You're a genius. Tony Hawk, here we come. I recognize this lobster. It's Larry the Lobster from SpongeBob. My oh, favorite TV show. His face. It's a bird. Excuse you. If I could figure out what kind of bird that is, perhaps like a canary or like a, a fern. Larry Canary, maybe? <gasps> it's Wait, no. Larry Bird. Isn't that like a golfer? Larry Bird definitely sounds familiar. Guys, comment below. Larry Bird, look it up or something. Who is that guy? Are we going to meet a famous person right now? Larry Bird has part of the key to the safe. Okay, let's go find him. B, this is it. This is the skate park right here. Just got to drop in. Woo! Yeah. Dropping in. Oh my gosh! That hurt your booty? Yes. You okay, Abby? No. Oh, you skinned your elbow. Wait, is that a clue? <laughs> you go up there, Chad, since you know how to skate. And I know how to walk. Oh, that is slippery. What is it? Whoa! I'm coming down, V. Check this out. This is fan mail. Fan mail? Why? What is it doing in the skate park? I don't know. Here, open it. 2V, you and Chad and Daniel and Regina are my favorite YouTubers. There's a letter to Daniel, there's a letter to me, and a letter to Regina. This is from Isling or Aisling from Dublin, Ireland. That's so cool. But what the heck is it doing here at the skate park? Maybe Dax is working for Project Zorgo again and didn't deliver our mail? Project Zorgo members have been here for sure. So there's gotta be something else related to the key to the safe. Let's keep looking. Hey, look, basketball courts. Wait, it's all coming back to me now. Larry Bird was a basketball player back in the day. So maybe the clue is in the basketball court? Maybe there's a clue in the hoop or something. Uh, oh, let me throw my uh, my hat up there. Uh, Wait, Daniel, there's something right here. I don't see anything. Up. Oh, let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. What? Hey. <gasps> Whoa, check it out. It's a piece of paper with two holes. It's like it's a Christmas tree. And look, look over here. There's like a stocking. Santa Claus comes down the chimney. My mom always used to say, Santa Claus gonna come down. Wait, wait a minute, look. This, I think, I think this goes to something else. This, we found a piece of paper. Where is it? I oh, you kept it on you. I did. Like this. Keep them together. It fits perfectly. 
<gasps> oh my gosh, Daniel! So look, this is a picture of me. It's a little water damage right now for some reason. I don't know how I got water damage huh, like that. I wonder. Those are probably your parents, your mom and your dad, and Project Sorgo took your family photo and ripped their faces off! So, if we found a piece of the picture right here, and another piece right here, there's gotta be two more pieces of their actual faces! There's gotta be more clues around here somewhere. Look! A box! All right! Woo! Whoa, I think it is more fan mail! Check it out! To Chad and V from your biggest, biggest fan. fan! Cool, let me open this one, Chad! Okay, I'll take the camera. I can't wait to see what it is! Yeah, more fan mail! Maybe it's a key! Oh, 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 Where are you? Babe? In the dumpster? Oh my god! Daniel, no! Don't go through the garbage! Ah. Oh, oh my god! What? Look! What is it? No, don't, don't. To Daniel from mom. Is it a my, present? My mom must have known I was here and she's trying to get in contact with me. It's a present from your mom. Let's open this thing. Okay. Oh. 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 oh my gosh. What the heck? I can't see anything. Okay, just try opening your eyes. Ah, it hurts. The sun's too bright! Project Zorgo's always setting up flash boxes on us! I carry a CWC bandana. This will protect your eyes from the sun. It won't hurt as much. Okay. It still hurts, but it, it does feel better now with the headband on. Well, anyway, what was in this box? It's empty! Project Zorgo was tricking us! They probably set up this real fan mail next to this box to trick us and make us open this flash box. Okay, V, we need to get out of this skate park right now. There could be hackers coming. Follow my voice. Yeah, you're doing great. Now, you're gonna be turning towards your left. I'm just gonna have to pull you up oh, this way, V, to your left. Stop, stop. Up, 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 up. There you okay. go. One, two, three, go. Ah, yes! I don't want you to fall on your bum again. We're out of the skate park now. Boy, shh, shh. Where are you? Look at this. I can't see anything. Oh yeah, don't look at this. There's a hacker up ahead. I think he's on the phone or something. What the heck was that? Uh, oh, God, it was so loud. Uh, oh, ah! Uh, uh, ah, uh, hacker! Regina, come on! I'm right here! Regina, are you coming? Daniel, take the camera! Hey, Regina, give me the camera! What? Daniel, I just said that! Wait, you can't get up? He's right there! Good luck finding me, buddy! Hey, man, you cased us off! Let me out! Oh, he's going down the slide! Uh, hey, Daniel, we gotta go back down! Regina, we should go back down! I just said that! Come on! Maybe you should walk in front of me and I'll guide you, okay? Now, just be careful, because this hacker's right up ahead. Now, you gotta stay a little bit too... Oh. Oh. Hey, Avi, I got you. I got you. Come here. Oh, oh my gosh, feed the hacker almost hurt us. That did not work. This time, you follow me. Actually, hold my hand this time. Okay. We gotta hear what he's saying on the phone very quietly, like a spy ninja. The key ain't no longer at the skate park because we change the location of the key every hour to keep it safe. Wait, did the hacker say that the location of the key changed every hour? Hey, there's a clue to where the new location of the key is in the tunnel slide. It's only 10 more minutes is a new hour, so we need to get to those. You just almost picked my nose. Oh my god! We, no. we, we need to get to the before they move that clue again. Let's go, V. Here, okay. follow me. You can feel the fence as you walk. That'll guide you. So I don't even need you anymore, huh, Chad? You don't need me. Yeah, I don't Come need on, you. Come on, V. Now that you're uh, blind, am I better looking or worse looking now? I feel like that's a trick question I shouldn't answer. Says you got the fence there. I'm feeling pretty confident that you can find your way without me now that you don't need me anymore. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, oh, oh. Are you okay? I tripped. Wait, where are you? Is hey, it you? Hey, you're touching the camera. Oh. Oh my gosh, V. I really hurt my leg on that trip wire. If there's any clues that are high up, you're gonna have to get it for me, V. Hopefully. I'm a tiny spine ninja. I can't do that. I can I can assist you. I'll tell you where to go. Five more minutes. I think they're moving that clue, V. Be careful of the bird poop, Daniel. Ah, uh, uh, oh, what the heck? There's bird poop down there, Regina. I just told you. Why didn't you warn me? Help me up, Regina. Why you just touch bird poop? Regina, what are you doing? Help me up. You just touched Help bird me up, Regina. What? Why aren't you helping me? Ah, uh, 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 my ears. 
You haven't been listening to any- Hey, Regina! I don't know what happened to my ears, but they hurt! Do you even hear me right now? I think when I opened the flash box, something detonated and like, I hear a ringing in my ears now. Hello! Daniel! Oh my gosh! Regina, I don't think I can hear you right now. What? Daniel, you must have hearing damage I right must now. have hearing damage or something. I'm gonna help him out. Hold the camera. We gotta prevent the damage from getting worse. Oh. Wait, guys, look. Over here, Daniel. Right uh, what, here. What, what, what? Sign language. We could use this to communicate. What? Regina, I can't hear you. Look right here, Daniel. Your eyeballs, right here. Regina, look, sign language. Yes, Daniel, I've been Maybe thinking. I can find a way to use the sign language to communicate with you. Yes, try out a word. Okay, maybe I'll try out a word. Okay. Oh my gosh. Uh. So you're doing that. P, okay? Wait, that's an O. Another O, okay? Dan, wait, Daniel, what the heck? P-O-O-P? Poop, really? Do you know what I spell, Regina? It spells poop. <laughs> I may have lost one of my senses, but I still have a sense of humor <laughs> and a sense of smell. Uh. I smell poop, Regina. It could be a clue. Let's get out of here. It smells like poop. I see a tunnel slide right there. Don't I, worry. I don't see it, Jax. You gotta tell me. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't worry. I got it. Even though my leg is injured. Crawling up. Here we go. I see something. Ah! I can't climb up in my leg, and I'm too big. You're gonna have to do it for me. What? My leg is injured, and I'm too big to climb into that little hole. So I'll guide you, okay? To, to your left, to your left. There's a step coming up. Yeah, there it is. Oh my gosh. You're doing great, V. Wait, what happened to that? There's no more steps. Now turn to your left. Step, one more step. Feel your foot. Feel my foot? I mean, feel the area by your foot. Down, down, down. Okay. Wait, oh, oh, you just push the envelope down the slide. What? Now you gotta go down the slide, V. You got this. Oh I'm coming. What? Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, it's so hot! Oh my gosh! <laughs> I'm burning my skin! You, you did it, V! Yeah, now you read it, V. Okay. What's it say? I can't say anything, Jack! Oh, oh yeah, I forgot. It's a, it's a molecule, but it's made out of raspberries and blackberries and blueberries. What kind of chain is it, Chad? Uh, is it like bond? What kind of bond? Cohesive Fru bond? Fruity bond. Fruity bond. Berry bonds. Berry bonds is a baseball player. How do you know that? Because. Because you're old. Maybe we have to go to that baseball field. I think that's nearby here. That's got to be where they're keeping the key to the safe. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Dude, be sorry. <laughs> I forgot to guide you. <laughs> we only got like one minute to get to the baseball field. What? One minute? I can make it there. Maybe you should go without me. Yeah, you wait right here. I'll be right back. I'm gonna go to the baseball field. I gotta get that key. Shh. We gotta be quiet. Daniel. There's a. Daniel. Uh oh. Maybe you should just shouldn't talk. The hacker almost caught us. I'm not a fan of cannolis, but I do like the cream in the middle. But the outside part, no, not for me. Shh. Don't. Talk because you are loud. Don't speak. Yeah, okay. Don't talk. You're the one who brought up cannolis. Gosh. I wasn't talking about cannolis. Yeah, I left a bunch of clues that lead to the key to the safe around these trees over here. We can't have any spy ninjas find these clues. Gina, what are we doing? Daniel, shh. Just be quiet, okay? They ain't gonna find it. I put it in a real good hiding place. All right, I'm out of here. See you later. The hacker said he left clues in this area. Daniel, listen to me. Look for clues. Did anybody ever tell you have nice teeth? <sighs> I get that quite a... Oh, anyway, no, Daniel. We need to look for clues. Me and you. Yes. Use your eyes. Yes. To search. Oh, we need to look for what? Clues. Ow. Clues, Daniel. Oh, like notes? Clues. Let's split up. Split up? And then meet here. Okay, if you need me, just call me. This is the baseball field. I hope I'm not too late. Maybe the clues under the pitcher's mound. What do we have here? Oh, it doesn't lift up. Maybe it's underneath the uh, home plate here. Let's check. Okay. Nope. So once we get the key to the safe, then we can open it, and then inside the safe, we'll destroy Project Zorgo forever. Yeah, that safe, you guys, I've worked so hard for it. It took me three months, so I really, really, really want to get inside that safe. We just need that key. Gosh, we, I feel like the, we're halfway there. It's gonna happen soon. Gosh, and then once we get inside, 
It's just gonna destroy Project Zergo. Oh! Chad? Chad, are you back? Chad? Hacker said he left clues in trees around this area. Not in those trees. Let's check out these trees. Ah! Ah! I trip! Ah! Hackers! Wait! Daniel! Daniel! Wait! Daniel! They can't hear me! He can't hear me because he's so... Let go of me! Ah! Ah! I don't see anything under the home plate. Oh! Oh! Whoa! Oh! Hey! Look at these hackers! What do you... You think you're Batman? <laughs> Get it, Batman? We the Super Smash Brothers! There's any clues over here. I've been looking for so long. There's nothing else. I don't know where Regina went, but I'm gonna call her. I can't hear, but she can hear me. Come on, Regina, pick up the phone. What? Call failed? Regina always answers her phone. Okay, whatever. I'm gonna call Chad. Calling Chad. Uh, call failed? What the heck? I'll call V. She always answers. Uh, what? I failed too! Why is nobody picking up their phones? They always answer their phones unless, unless they're in trouble. Did the hackers take them or something? Could I be next? You know what has to be done? In my Spy Ninja backpack, I've been carrying the safe around. Okay guys, this is the safe I've been talking about. This is the safe that once we open it, something inside is gonna defeat Project Zorgo forever. But if they're coming for me, I gotta like hide it. All right, where's a good hiding place for this? How about in here? All right, look guys, the safe is right there. You can barely see it. It's in the leaves of that tree. Remember this for me, guys. It's next to that blue bench with the words written on there. I guess I'll just sit here, try to defend myself. It's so weird, the flash boxes. Usually, you open them up, it just makes you blind. But it made me deaf. Hello, hello. It must be like a new contraption or something Treasure Zorgo is making. They're always like in innovating and making new technology. Hello. And I thought I was ah. like, oh. Wait a minute. I can see. I can see you guys. Where am I? I'm in a box? Hey! Let me out! Hello? Oh no! It's a spy gadget! Someone's trying to break in! Easy Queen! Project Zargo Hacker! Shut your mouth back there. We got a drive to take. Hey, who are you? Let me out of here! Don't worry about it. Just stay put. This is just a cardboard box, Hacker. I can just break out of here easily. You try it and you'll never see your spy ninja friends again. Is Chad and Daniel and Regina with you? Hello? Uh, no one's responding. Let me call them. Come on, Chad. BB, are you okay? I'm still in this cardboard box. Wait, where, where's Daniel and Regina? Oh, man. Oh my gosh, I'm in a cardboard box. No, wait a minute. Wait. Hey, 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 hey. I can hear again. My hearing's back. I opened this flash box and I was deaf for a little bit. You know what? I don't remember my past at all, but I do remember being trapped in a cardboard box. And it's happening again. Well, wait a minute. Yeah, we're definitely moving right now. What the heck? I called Regina, Chad, and V, and they didn't answer their phones. I thought they got taken. Maybe we're all in cardboard boxes right now. Maybe we're all in a car or something together. Okay, I'm gonna call Regina right now and see where she is. Daniel's calling. Daniel, what's up? I'm in a box. Wait, Daniel, you can hear me? Yes. I'm so glad you got your hearing back. Wait, I hear a hacker talking. Hey, Spy Ninjas, you got something that we hackers want. Now, we could have done this the easy way, but you forced us to do it the PZ way. You know what? I think it's that PZ44. I think that's the New York hacker. He's probably driving the vehicle that we're in right now. Wait, wait, wait. What, what, what do you see? What? You get the safe back in Project Zorgo's hands. Otherwise, you'll be swimming with the fishes. Capiche? With the fishes? Good thing I love fish. Wait, did he say swimming with the fishes? I don't want to be swimming with the fishes. I can't swim, you guys. I don't have my life jacket with me either. Tell us where you put the safe. Well, it's going to be a long ride. Wait a minute. The safe? I don't even know where the safe is. The last time I saw the safe, we were playing baseball or something. I haven't seen it since. Daniel, did you hear that? Daniel? Daniel? Chad, do you know where the safe is? Chad? 
Chet, are you still there? What the heck? She hung up. I think she might be in trouble. The hacker's been looking for the safe for a very long time, so we cannot let them take the safe. With that safe, we can destroy them forever. Hey, Chad, Daniel, V, what should we do? Can you guys even hear me? Are you guys here right now? Don't even try to escape them boxes, or me and my pallies will make sure you never see the light of day. Since I can't break out of this box, I'm just gonna explore around, and you guys can help me if you guys find any clues or anything important that I should know about. Looks like it's just a cheap box that they can get in anywhere. Just held together by tape. Whoa, what is this? It says blank blank a face, blank blank frown, I blank blank that do not wave, I blank day long. Why do Project Zargos insist on always giving us clues and riddles like this? If you guys know the answer to this or have any idea what this is, please leave a comment below. Chad? B, Daniel, answer me, hello? Guys, I think this box is soundproof. Oh, wait, guys, look. A clue or something. There's writing right here. Twin brothers blank blank and thin blank blank dishes rather blank blank. What twin brothers could they be talking about? There's the Dolan twins and the Dobre twins, Lucas and Marcus. Oh, are they part of Project Sorgo? What else do we have in here? A speaker? Why is there a random speaker in here? Okay, guys box is actually kind of roomy well because i'm kind of a tiny spy ninja guys there's another riddle written on this side of the box right here it says blank blank with long blank blank bodies prefer blank blank than soup whoa i love soup you guys is this box meant for me what does that mean where are they taking me they're taking me to somewhere with water or are they taking me somewhere with water that's soup that i can eat could it be a body of water or a full plate I'm actually kind of hungry right now. Yeah, what a lovely day to take some spy ninjas over to a mysterious location. People like to complain about the traffic over here. It's nothing like Manhattan, I'll tell you. You get down to uh, 42nd Street, you'll never see it empty like this, that's for sure. Guys, there's another clue. Do you guys see that right here? It says, I have blank blank that doesn't blank have hands blank 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 blank. Don't walk, but I move all blank blank. What am blank? That's a lot of blanks, guys. That's gonna be a hard riddle to solve, so if you guys can help me out, leave a comment down below. Guys, I wonder if Chad, V, and Daniel also have speakers in their boxes. If they also have speakers, I could hack onto this one, and then maybe I could hear V, or she could hear me. I'm gonna try to hack onto this. Our genius is back at it again. A little bit of that, a little bit of this, and... I don't know if this will work, but hack! Hello? Hello? Are you Uber Eats? Hello? V, it's me, Regina. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Regina, where are you? It worked! My hack worked! I hacked onto your speaker. I'm trapped in a cardboard box! So am I! I'm in a box too! Wait, you're not in a soup restaurant? I wish I was in the soup restaurant! The hacker gave me a riddle with soup in it! It's like tormenting me, because I'm hungry! Oh gosh, I'm now I'm hungry too! V, I think I'm in a moving car right now! We must be in the same car, Regina! V, if we're in the same car, what if I just bust out of this cardboard box and get you out of there too? Wait, don't do that! If I break out of this cardboard box, I'm never gonna see a spy ninja again! What? That's awful! I don't even want to know what that means! I don't know what that means either! But hey, have you heard from Chad or Daniel at all? I actually, I talked to Daniel for like a little bit, but then my signal got cut off. I talked to Chad and his cut off too. Where are they? Maybe we're in like a semi or something huge. In my box, I found some clues. There was some, a lot of words with blank spaces, something about twin brothers. What? That's weird because there's like two riddles with a lot of blank spaces too. Maybe our riddles like connect somehow. Wait a minute. If we put it together, do you think it forms a sentence? I think it might. Okay, you read yours. Twin brothers with long and thin bodies prefer dishes rather than soup. <gasps> we completed it. Oh my gosh, that makes sense. Wait, they're talking about twin brothers that are skinny? Do you know any twin brothers that are skinny with long bodies? Lucas and Marcus, they're pretty skinny and they're twins. Why would Lucas and Marcus have anything to do with this? Do they like soup? They might be soup lovers, I don't know. Maybe this has nothing to do with the twins at all. Maybe it's just a riddle. Wait, Buffy, it says the twin brothers don't like soup. They prefer dishes. What kind of things don't like soup? I know when I eat soup, I like to eat it with a spoon. You gotta slurp up that juicy broth, you know, unless you eat like Asian noodle soups, like pho, you definitely need a pair of chopsticks for that. Chopsticks, V? Chopsticks are thin, and you could call them twins because they, they look like each other. That's the answer to the riddle! Pair of chopsticks! 
What do we do with the information about chopsticks, though? That's not gonna save us. What's this? These right here are chopsticks, and that's the answer to the riddle. So what can I do with these? Three, two, one. Hey, oh, do you guys see that? It's like some sort of keypad. Maybe this is my way out of here. If you spy ninjas know any codes that could get me out of here, leave a comment down below. Now this I like. Let's try 700. Hey, who turned off that song? I'm trying to hear some smooth jazz. What kind of crap is this? Two, three, four, enter. Wait a minute, somebody messing with my radio or something? Sounds like something they'd listen to in New Jersey. The hacker's getting mad because his radio is changing. I've been changing the radio station this whole time. But this song isn't that bad though. I don't know why he's complaining. Maybe I'll change the station. It'll get him to stop the car or something. Eh, hey, wise guy, yeah? Well, nobody messes with PZ44. Ah, you want to race, eh? Yeah? Let's see how you do against my turbo. All right, buddy, let's go. Whoa, wait, is your car moving super fast, Regina? Ah, speedball, my gosh. Ah! Hey, you guys be quiet back there. Shut your yappers if you know what's good for you. Well, if you can just drive more smoothly, then I don't have to be loud. Crazy drivers in this town, I tell you. Hey, V, are you still there? Are you okay? I'm still here. They don't know how to drive. Project Oracle can't do anything. I have another clue in my box. Do you have another one? Yeah, I have another one. I have two blanks at the beginning of it. And I have two words in the beginning of it. So if we just do the same thing, I think we'll complete each other's sentences. I have a face that doesn't frown. I have hands that do not wave. I don't walk, but I move all day long. What am I? Oh, what are they talking about? I have no idea. Do the spy ninjas know? You guys, if you know, please comment down below. A face and hands that don't wave. What? Wait, do fishes have hands? Do they? They have fins. Those are like their hands. I don't know, because, you know, they don't walk. They swim. Wait, do they wave? They don't wave, no. They don't wave? I don't know. They're trying to torture us over here with things that we like. I like soup. You like fish? What is this? Oh, gosh. All this talk about soup and fish is making me a little bit hungry. What time is it, V? How long have we been in here? Wait a minute. Did you say time? Time? Clock? Regina, a clock is round. It has a face, but it doesn't frown. Oh my gosh, and it also has hands. And it moves all day, but it can't walk. Yes, it's a clock. Yeah, you're right. Wait, but what does that mean? How do we get out of here? I don't know. Wait a minute, Fee. When I was in Project Zorgo, all of the hackers took their lunch breaks at noon. What time is it now? Let me check my phone. It's 11 o'clock right now. It's 11? Okay, I have a great idea. I could hack onto the car's dashboard clock and put it an hour ahead so that it says noon. The hacker driving this car will go on a lunch break and stop his car and we can bust right out of here. Ooh, that is a great idea. Are you ready to battle royale if we bust out of here? I guess I'll have to. I can do it if you're with me. Yeah, just be brave. Don't be afraid. We can do it, Regina. Thanks, V. Get ready to hack, Regina. The genius is coming back for part two, guys. You know how I do it. A little bit of this and that. And hacking. Set it to noon. Set. Did it work? He's getting out of his car. This is our chance. Okay, let's get out of here. Please, please. Ah, he's back, he's back. Why is that so quick? He didn't even stop for our lunch. Yeah, did he inhale his food or something? He just got out of the car and got back in. Okay, hold on. Let me look through the hole again. Don't get shot for picking me up. He's with another hacker. He just picked up someone. Dang it, there's two of them now. Oh my gosh, I hope it's not PZ9. Wait, let me listen. Okay, I can't hear anything, so fill me in. I'm really close to them. That was a good mission the other day. We got to play some baseball. You got to play baseball? Yeah, it was pretty fun. Me and PZ9, we beat up on the Spy Ninjas. Oh, you beat them up. I think it's Foomph. I recognize that voice. The German hacker. Oh, I think I know what's in the safe. Oh, they're talking about the safe right now. I actually don't know where the safe is right now. Do you? I have no idea where the safe is right now. This is bad. But at least Project Zorgo doesn't know where the safe is either. I know. I think Chad or Daniel hid it somewhere. I think Lederhosen in safe. Lederhosen? Oh my gosh, PZ Foom does not know what's in the safe. Well, you know why? Because only high-ranking members get to the safe. And I was obviously a high-ranking member. But he's hoping in the safe is a new Lederhosen. A Lederhosen? 
Frozen? What's that gonna do? I don't know, but it's Oktoberfest. Maybe he's gonna go to it. Oh, huh, that does make sense. He's thinking ahead of the game. DC44. Yeah? Do you see that Spy Ninja video, the one where they're squishing squishies with their car? I did, that was pretty good. <laughs> <gasps> I loved it so much. Oh my gosh, Regina, you won't believe what happened. PZ Foom just complimented on our squishy video. They liked it. No one can resist the oddly satisfying feeling. It felt so good. Yeah, they really liked it. Maybe Project Zorgo secretly loves us and they're just jealous. Hey, uh, Foom, what happened to your mask there? What happened? What happened? Looks like you got a little malfunction over here. What? I'm scared. Why? Don't worry about it. It's fine. Whoa. Did you just hear a seagull? We're getting close to the ocean. What? The ocean? I don't have my life vest with me. This isn't good. Oh my gosh. They're bringing us to a body of water. I can't, I can't swim, you guys. Does that mean we're not in Las Vegas anymore? Well, there's no oceans around Las Vegas. Oh my gosh. Where are they bringing us? V, do you hear like monkeys? Monkeys? Weird like, ooh, ah, ah. Yes, I hear them. How are we in the jungle? How long have we been traveling for? Yeah, I don't know. Are, we, are they bringing me back to Vietnam? going closer to the ocean and now it sounds like we're going towards a jungle what if they take us to some like wild animals that could eat us or something the, i don't want them to like drop us off in the jungle or anything i'm not ready for this we just need to calm down project zorgo is probably just messing with us they know my fears is water and they know that you don't like insects and crazy creepy crawlers i think we just need to take a deep breath and just calm down i do feel better happy thoughts calm thoughts <laughs> I think he pulled over. He's getting out of the car. Here's your dinner for tonight. Wait a minute. A York and a baby Ruth. I'm not gonna eat candy from strangers, especially from Project Zorgo members. Guys, do not eat candy from strangers. But maybe these can be clues. York and baby Ruth. What do they have in common? That hacker, he's from New York. He has a New York accent. Are we going to New York? Am I gonna see the Statue of Liberty? Regina, Regina, I think we're going to New York. I love New York. We can get some hot dogs go to Times Square, you know, do all the touristy things. But wait, no, that won't be good. I don't want to be in New York with Project Zorgo. And also, we need to protect the safe. That's way more important right now. You gotta be kidding me with this. Pigeons decide to doo-doo all over my car. What are they feeding pigeons nowadays, yogurt? This is gonna take hours to clean, jeez. All right, let's try the wipers. Oh man, it's getting all over my car. Oh my gosh, you guys, the hacker stopped. He's getting out of the car. Is that hacker? He's looking at me. I think they're moving me. Ah, they just dropped me. Oh no, he's running away. I'm just gonna break out of here. Yeah! I'm in the 